our Bay Area is one of the best places to live. It isn't just because of the beautiful weather and great scenery. It is because of the people here. Our people are diverse, innovative, activists, and most of all, authentic. It is no wonder that Satan has put a foothold here. We are drowning in violence with overwhelming news of hate-filled and callous acts pouring in from all over the Bay, perpetrated by an anti-Christ culture that has led us to a state of spiritual poverty. It is easy to feel hopeless and numb to the senseless violence and moral decay in our communities. But that is not an option for us as Christ believers. We have a mandate in Leviticus 19.16 to not stand idly by while our neighbor's life is threatened. So how do we respond? With 2 Corinthians 10.14, the weapons of our warfare are not weapons of this world. Instead, they have divine power to demolish strongholds. What is this weapon? Our weapon is prayer. In James 5.16, it tells us the prayer of a righteous man has great power to prevail. Our weapon is the gospel, Romans 1.16. I am not ashamed of the gospel because it has the power of God for salvation to everyone who believes. It is time that we tap into this power. We must take action. We must pray to see this power become a reality in our streets. 1 Corinthians 4.20 For the kingdom of God is not just a lot of talk. It is living by God's power. We have done enough talking. Now it is time to act. If you're hungry to see the power of God transform lives here in our Bay Area communities, sign up. Partner with us in prayer at the Truth Outreach and just watch what our God will do. It's very simple to join. You submit your name, city, and email address at www.thetruthoutreach.org slash pray for the bay and we will send you Bay Area focused prayer points and praise reports every week. We look forward to the harvest of souls that will take place in our communities as we pray for the Bay.